welcome back everyone this video is a continuation of my previous video where i showed you how to create a database and tables today i want to show you how to insert values into your tables so before that i want to quickly remind you how the excel file looked like that i created um, this is a reference sheet so we can take a look at how our tables will look like on sql um, the first thing the, or the table I want to show you is the activities table. Uh, the other ones you can do on your own. It's the same process. So as long as you understand how to insert the values, you will be fine. Okay, so we go back to table plus and I already inserted the first value. And the command is insert into and then you have the table's name. So mine is called the activities table and I say values and now I have to know which column comes first. So in my case, the ID is first, so the activity ID. So I'm on number two now and then whatever is on second column, which is bowling in my case. Okay, and I close it with a semicolon and I say run current and you should see here it says query one okay, one row affected, which means it successfully inserted the value. So I'm just gonna do this with all the values in this table. Okay, successful. Perfect, and the last one. Basketball. Okay, so once you finish this, you can take a look at your table and you have to refresh it. It will not automatically show. And voila, you will see all of the activities in your table. Okay, so I already filled in the other table, the grades table as well. Um, and I would highly suggest you to fill in all the tables, okay? You can follow the Excel file that I created and in the next video, I'm going to show you how to join the tables, uh, which means this table here will make much more sense to you, okay? So thank you for watching and I hope you could learn something today. Please make sure to tune in in the next video because I will show you the coolest thing of all and that is how to join these tables.